Adam Gatt's been here 17 and a half years. Started two weeks after I graduated high school. Um, started off kind of, you know, at the beginning like you do at most companies, working on boilers, cleaning them out, cleaning out uh, pits in the uh, city of Norfolk, you know, kind of rougher jobs and got into the mechanical work, uh, rigging work. Um, moved up to truck driving, um, you know, after being here like 17 and a half years, I uh, got my crane certification and I uh, helped facilitate all the uh, logistics of the uh, trucking division. One job that was real memorable was actually like one of the first ones when I started working here. Um, we had to uh, clean out some pits where they had a pump system that had screens. There were all the the uh, rainwater and wastewater and stuff from the streets would go down into a pit and we had to go in there and cut out the old screens, put new screens in, and we had to clean all the debris from the sewer out and take it out with five gallon buckets and shovels and it was under the road in the middle of August and uh, it was a pretty interesting, pretty interesting job. And I got crane certified, I got the crane certification because uh, you know, I started getting more into at driving and being around the rigging and it was always cool we'd always have cranes or boom trucks or stuff come out to our jobs and it always interested me and I thought it was you know pretty cool so started learning more about it and started wanting to operate it myself so I went and got the certification so I could start doing it myself. The coolest thing is I don't you know every day is a little bit different you're not ever really doing the same thing every job is a little bit different it's you know it's never uh, it's not boring, it's always exciting. There's always something new. Um, it's just, it's a fun job. Maybe the hardest part is, um, it's a lot, I mean, it could be a lot of work. You know, there's sometimes there's a lot, a lot of load put on you, but um, you know, it's, at the same time, it's exciting because you get a load put on you and you're like, man, I don't know how I'm gonna do all this. And then you end up getting it all done and you're like, wow, I got it done. So it gives you some like self -grat gratification that, you know, you got it all done. My time since I've been here, I mean, it, a lot of uh, the equipment. I mean, when I started, there was only one semi, one boom truck, you know, one building we all worked out of. You know, now we've got, you know, six semis, boom, you know, newer boom trucks, newer cranes, newer equipment, a lot of facility. You know, there's just been a lot of growth in the field, the office, and just power mechanical in general. There's just a lot of upper mobility. Like a lot of our older, you know, a lot of our older equipment and stuff, you know, it was, it was older equipment, it was a newer company, so you know, you don't get all brand new equipment. So, you know, everything had been used and abused and then you're trying to get the most out of it, most out of the equipment to get the job done safely with, you know, some equipment that always, maybe not always in the best of shape, but, uh, you know, we worked with what we had, we made the most out of it to get a job done. New, somebody new coming in, I'd, you know, tell them, just like I, you know, tell them, when I meet them nowadays, you know, I started here at a young age and I've been here for a while and, it, you know, it's a great, great company. Um, you know, there's no real ceiling, you know, as hard as you work you, and as hard as you want to work and you, you'll get out of it what you put in it, you know. Um, if you work hard, there's places to go as long as you want to work for it.